Whatever you do, don't look behind you. Run! Welcome back to our next indie horror game, The Exit 8. Uh, if I'm to understand this correctly, we are stuck in a looping corridor, and the only way out of it is to reach the 8th exit. And the only way to do that is to very carefully observe this hallway and the things in it as we loop around it and try and spot subtle things that change because if we miss them then it resets so <clears throat> all right start here we got a dentist poster looks like a restaurant advertisement dog salon advertisement I don't know what that's for. Makeup art, movie poster, and a security camera. Warning there. There's a camera up there. There's one back there. Here's that sign. There's a sign there. Got three doors here. All right. Keep left. Right, so we're currently in hallway zero, and the idea is to make it to hallway eight, and then we get out of it. So, all right. Somebody's coming here. He just. Oh, oh, nothing. Just, just gonna walk on by like I'm not here. All right. I don't see anything different from the first time. Okay, it's still on zero, so we missed we missed something. Somewhere in that hallway, something changed between the first two, and I missed it. None of these posters look different. Yeah, see, here's the guide. Don't overlook the anomalies. If you find anomalies, turn back immediately. If you don't find anomalies, do not turn back. So, if we see something change in the hallway, we have to turn around and go back down the hallway we just came from, rather than continuing forward. So... I expect some of the differences will have to do with him because he he shows up in the corridor each time it loops. So Yeah, see there weren't there weren't either yeah, so there weren't any in that hallway. So it went up to one. There's not every hallway will have an anomaly in it, apparently. Sometimes it's just a normal fucking hallway. Like.
Yeah, see, that was just another normal corridor. Because it, it went up to two. So, alright. We've made it to hallway two. Only six more to go. Nothing, nothing's changed with the... Oh, shit. Um. That's not normal. The posters are slowly growing in size. Okay. So, fuck that. Backwards. Yeah, see? There we go. Hallway 3. Those self-growing posters were the anomaly for that corridor. Alright. Good, good, good. Uh, that's not normal either. There's the imprint of a person way down there in the wall. Yep, not walking... <laughs> not walking past that. So, alright, now we're on hallway four. What the fuck? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh, God. That was some... fucking flood of bloody-ass water, like... some shit out right out of The Shining there. Still nothing's happened with him, though. Which is interesting. Alright, we're up to six. Keep up the good work here. We're gonna get out of this fucking horse shit. Okay. That door is doorknob and lock are in the middle of the door rather than on the side, so I guess that counts. This dude's just back here checking his Hello You trapped in this bullshit with me or are you part of it? No, he's not talking. Alright. Alright. Come on, hallway eight. There we go. Wait, why did it loop? Shouldn't this be the end? Maybe we have to do it one more time after it hits eight. And then it then we can get out. Nope. 
I don't see anything different. So if, if we didn't miss anything in that hallway, we should be good. Yeah, there we go. And we didn't miss any. We got the achievement for finding all of the anomalies in that playthrough as well. So, um, that's pretty interesting. It's a pretty interesting game. I'm gonna have to. You could replay that, you know, multiple times and get totally different anomalies because I very much doubt that the ones we saw were the only ones in the game. There were probably a lot. That that man has to have something to do with something. Uh, all anomalies found. Thank you for using our underground passageway. Why the hell am I still in it? Well, this, this poor guy, <laughs> he's still here. Let's, let's, let's take another walk around this and see if we get different shit. Like, uh, We missed something. Wait, no. So that was the start. That was the start of zero. Or maybe I missed one. Or maybe, maybe, okay. <clears throat> oh, it went up to one. Okay. Oh, shit. So, all of those posters changed to the same poster. So, that, that one didn't happen the last time. That's a new one. The lights are fucked up. The lights are all crooked. See, we're getting different ones this time than we got the first go around. Uh, that didn't happen the last time either. The eyes on the security camera poster are moving. Whoa, what the fuck? There's a creepy face on the ceiling. It's very faint, but you, you can see that, right? It looks like a... A screaming ghost or something. I almost, if I hadn't looked straight up, I would have missed that. Because that's, it's not really, that's not a super obvious one like some of them are. He still hasn't done anything, though. Alright, we're almost out again. Be very, very careful for these. Oh, shit. He is... Speed walking. That's not... Ah! Uh, yeah, we're gonna run away from him. Because that's definitely not... 
That was definitely not normal. Alright. Oh, God. What the fuck? Got some dudes, twin, down there pulling the, uh, the little girls from the Shining bullshit over there. Yep. No thanks. No thank you. I'm good with that. Well, I don't see anything. So we should be good to walk out again. Come on, stairs. Come on, stairs. Yeah! Right, see? I don't bet we still haven't seen them all. I bet there's more. Like, we could just keep doing this until I don't know how many anomalies, you know, total are possible. But, I mean, there was a good chunk of them right there. Um, well, I'll leave some of them for you to, you know, find out for yourself. Maybe you, you get some on some that I didn't get. Um, but, all right. Here you go. There was two successful loops of the exit 8. With no mistakes whatsoever. I didn't miss anything at all. A little proud of myself for my observational skills there. <laughs> but I like that. That's good. It didn't... I don't have any problem with, you know, like the standard horror. You know, jump scares, horrible monsters. Horrible things happen to people. You know, it's, it's all fun and stuff, but... Yeah, that felt more like a puzzle, you know. You actually had to look for shit and think about it, you know. You actually have to pay attention. Like, you can't just can't just run through it or you're going to miss something and it'll just loop forever because it resets if you, if you miss one. So, all right. So, that was the Exit 8. The link for that is in the description. If you want to try that out for yourself, thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next game.